everyone. Just a quick video uh, intro here. I don't usually do these. I just throw the videos out there and hope for the best, but I thought I'd do a, a quick intro. Um, caught my personal best redfish uh, on this trip, and uh, it was 36 incher, and really a big boy or a big girl, whichever the case may be. Um, and actually tagged another one right after that. Uh, a lot of times they run in pairs, so I think I tagged the next one, but he got off, which was fine because I would have released him too. But uh, anyway, it was a wonderful fight. Had my new Waterloo Phantom rod uh, paired with a 2000 little spin cast reel, and it was, it was an awesome fight on 10 pound test. So they were hitting mullet, dead shrimp, uh, gulp, <laughs> so we used a lot of gulp up over the past couple of days, but we, um, we had a good time other than, uh, you know, the, the last day, which was the day right before duck season. The airboats were everywhere. They ran all day long. You could hear them in all directions, and it was like fishing at the Houston International Airport. So. We knew we weren't going to do real good that day. Um, had a boat cut right across the flat we were fishing in. Um, they didn't run over my line this time like they did last time. But fishing in a flat in a foot of water, and there's a channel over behind us that they could easily go down. But they have to cut right across the flat that we're fishing in. It, it's just, it's insane. I don't know if there's a lot of people that, that just don't know boat etiquette because they're new boat owners. I don't know. But the, the second day was just nuts because of all the traffic. Anyway, the first day was when I caught the big one, and we thoroughly enjoyed it and caught quite a nice variety uh, of fish. So anyway, hope you enjoy the video, and I'll, I'll stop my little rant right there. And as always, I'm a realtor, so if I can help you out, please let me know. I'm also an artist, and I have an Etsy shop, Bahia Art Designs. So take a look when you have a chance, and enjoy the video. Please like and subscribe. Thank you. This new rod did its job. Once again, I am the lizardfish queen. These things, I mean, ick. That's all I've got to say is ick. <laughs> you are beautiful. Look at him. Look how perfect he is. <laughs> Stay right there. I'm going to get that out of you. I knew he was there. All right, little fella. Yeah, I've definitely had a slam today. Get out of there. Go on. You're fine. <laughs> but he's an eater size. All right. Thank you. Yeah, he's a nice one. Hello, little dude. Yeah, just a shrimp. Look at 
him. I mean, wow, they are just going nuts over there. three and four and two coming out of the water. <laughs> yeah, Bob's got a little puffer fish. They are so cool. We'll, we'll save his little life. <laughs> so what you just saw there was somebody cutting across a flat that's a foot deep where we're fishing and you saw them throw up the mud where they cut right through the reef. Just, uh, no words for that. So, so much for your fishing. So, we have had to deal with this all day long. It's just one airboat after another. It's totally destroyed any peacefulness you could have out on the water today. They're not hunting. Not sure what they're doing. It's almost like a, an airboat convention down here. You can hear them in every direction. <laughs> 